Hey, everybody, and welcome back to Unapologetically Black and Fast. And we are in the Pokemon block. I, as you can't tell by what's sitting on top of my head, I am very excited for this. Uh, we're going to start it off with Mocha Jones. But while Mocha Jones is introducing themselves, I want everybody in chat to drop what their favorite Pokemon is. But Mocha, take us away. I want, I am Mocha Jones. Tim, uh, I'm going to be running Pokemon Scarlet Path of Legends. That means I'm going to be, uh, well, was, I'll explain it here in a bit. But first, I got to throw it to my main man. Uh, the purveyor of Pokemon uh, paraphernalia and postulations. Uh, Big Beast, go ahead and introduce yourself while I'm getting the run started. Hey, what's up, everybody? It is I, Big Beast, your happy, helpful harbinger of hype. Um, you know, we, we figure what, what better way to, uh, 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 you know, kick this off right than with, I mean, you know, Obviously, we gotta. I got. I just drug it from the back room. I brought out my big bag of bad facts. So, uh, why Mocha is out here being the best possible poker trainer that they can be? Um, Y'all hit me up with some questions, and uh, whenever we get some moments where Mocha needs to focus, I'm gonna hit you up with these. Uh, these definitely, totally, one hundred percent. Uh, you know, true facts. Facts are not true. <laughs> All right, but this is a fact. We are going to get started with this run, and I'm going to give it a five count. It starts on the first movement, so in five, four, three, two, one, go. All right, so the first thing we're going to do, just like in every run of this, we're just going to go shopping and buy three extra tags and, and get out, get up out of here. So, uh, bees, I see people putting like some Pokemon in chat already. Okay, I I, I got it. Oh, I asked everybody I'm, what their favorites were. Oh, yeah, everybody's putting their favorites. So uh, go ahead and take some of those and give some facts about them. Oh, definitely. Um, I would like to point out first, uh, one thing that, that hasn't been mentioned yet is that uh, we're super excited that the skies are clear. That it is yes. not raining yes, out right now. Yes, we are. Because yeah, that, wait, that, does that what, affect the game? Yeah, in the game. So, Mocha, let them know what, what happens when it rains. So, when it rains or when there's any kind of weather effect, it will actually drop the frame rate. That just, and just makes it unbearable worse. It's just too so cozy. having clear skies on this beautiful start of the day is just amazing right now. Love, love to see it. Let's see. Uh, I'm going to grab some of these Pokemon at random. <clears throat> uh let's see who who we got Sneasel. Okay. Um Sneasel, one thing that that is known about Sneasel in the Pokédex, uh after you read that original uh, uh little excerpt, uh one thing underneath it is that Sneasel uh only in winter months has that's how they got their name because they do not stop sneezing. And it actually becomes a problem for most of the community around them. Um, that it's just, it's just like no one gets to sleep. Uh, you know, it, it's just, it's real rough. So if you have a Sneasel, make sure that your Sneasel is taken care of, has all sorts of, uh, you know, tissues or just, you know, keep them, best, better yet, just keep them in the Poké Center for the winter months. Just, you know, do all your battling the other three seasons of the year and then just kind of let them rest for that time. We see you throw your hands up, Mocha. What's up? That's unfortunate. Uh, so this game is lovely in the fact that uh, hitboxes are weird. And you just saw an example of that. That that uh, flesh tender nowhere, nowhere where it should have been, and yet it just, it just jumped me like, no, uh, want to take my lunch money. So we got we got little birds coming out of nowhere trying to shake you down during this round. Oh yeah! All right, here's that rain. Here's that rain oh, that we no, talked no. about. That rain need to go away. I don't need no rain today. Mm -mm. Clear skies. Mm -hmm. Go away. Yep. I'm need everybody <laughs> to please, please help us out in chat. I need twos in chat to to just tell that two for shoe, shoe 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 shoe. shoe. Two shoot at, shoot get it right away. Get twos in chat, please. I got you. I got you. We in there. Hey. 
Yes. So Ooh. I do see I do see a very important question. What's um, this question? Now, now, uh, DJ Darkwing has yep. asked. Uh, it's been discussed that you know what happened to Mocha Jones one through nine. I was wondering if we can get a Mocha Jones seven fact. So I think this stream may take a quick detour. I think we may have to go from just uh, Poke Facts to Mocha Facts. You know, oh, I mean, you know. Because um, we now I'm picturing uh, Mocha's we'll coming out like that. Go, go ahead and declassify some of this. Are, are you sure? Yeah. No, let's do it. Okay. Uh, all right. Just a, couple, just a couple of facts. Just a couple of facts. All right. All right. So I will let you know that. Uh, the thing about Mocha Jones 7 is Mocha Jones 7 was born with two left hands, like legit two left hands uh, on the same side. So that was uh, that kind of, uh, you know, caused issues when it came to the big Mocha Royale. Um, so, you know, we, we, we will always remember uh, Mocha Jones 7, also known as Lefty. Um, so that's, that's one of our, our Mocha facts. <laughs> yeah, in the game, not much going on. We're just uh, getting back to where we were. <laughs> yeah. See, see, that was really funny. I'm just trying not to laugh very hard because before we got started, I, I made a bet that I wasn't going to drop this Militic plush off my head. And I don't have a flat head, so these makes me laugh too hard. This thing oh, is going don't, flying. Don't worry. I, oh, I'm, don't I'm worry. here don't to worry. take that plush out. There is another that's section like, coming up. There's gonna be a count. If you just if chat, if y'all just hear me go one, two, that that's how many times it fell off. The, it <laughs> fell off my head. Don't worry about it. If y'all just hear me just counting random numbers, it you know exactly. It was a flyby mugging. All right. Yeah. So now, right now, we are we are we are cursing the rain that is persisting, but at the same time, we are grabbing items and bobbing and weaving all these Pokemon trying to shake us down because it uh -huh. may look beautiful, but this is actually a really bad neighborhood. Um, they just got a whole bunch of like these Pokemon came in out of nowhere, started a Poke Gang, and it's just you know, just like right there. Look over there. See, you see a whole bunch of Poke Gang sheets. <laughs> mm -hmm. They saw us point at them and they ran off. That's the problem. But yeah. <laughs> <laughs> One. <laughs> <laughs> Right, yeah, check, check out new how, how many times they're rocking on the loser's hat? <sighs> oh, yeah. How many times they're going to lose his hat tonight? Yeah, there we go. Can we get it? Can Amaz <sighs> put a prediction up? I don't know where that accent came from. That that was almost two. <laughs> <laughs> and how many Pokemon am I going to hit tonight? You know, see, that's like the I should have been they send the, They send the, the, the little salt lick out there, and it's like, help me. They, they and that's when they come up behind you, and they DDT you. Ooh. They, they know that I'm trying to show up for the people. Mm hmm. And they just ain't gonna let me. That's all right. That's all right. We got, that's why we got on our, 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 our Bob and Weave shoes on. I can't stand the rain. Or the Missy Elliott. Yeah, especially if it's against my window. Mm mm. Let's see. <laughs> I'm gonna predict 30. Oh, we have oh snap. Chat started too. Okay, we got it. We got it up. How 30? many times? Somebody said thirty. No faith. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> How many times would J Rock lose his so, hat? Uh, we got one. We were going to say the three. purpose of this yeah. run, since we're about to start getting to the, the meat, the meat of it, is go. Um, in the intro section that I didn't play through because in the intro section that I didn't play through because. You know, uh, speed run. Yeah. Um, uh, Arvin asked us to collect these, uh, these plants, these Urbamisca. Mm hmm. And the protectors of these Urbamisca are called Titan Pokemon. And in order to get to the Urbamisca, no, Urbamisca is really hard to say. I'm just going to start saying HM from now on. Mm -hmm. To get to these HMs, you got to defeat the Titan Pokemon. So that's what we're working on right now. Nice. Now, uh, viewers, chat will notice and that. This one is called Cloth. It's the Stony, the Stony Cliff. Uh, yeah. So, Mocha, I have a question. All these. Is that fur or rocks around his leg? Yes. 
So, so Mocha, I have a, I have a question. Okay, what's your question? Chats here sees this wonderful run, and they see you using this, you know, unbelievably adorable grass cat. Uh, why? Yes. Why do you? I mean, there, are, there are. I mean, I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm not up. I'm not 100 percent up to date, but I think there are around at least seven different Pokemon. Um, you know, somewhere between. <laughs> there between, might be between, eight. There, there might be eight. Okay. Well, I know it's. I know it's somewhere between seven and six million. Um, so. <laughs> I was just wondering why this one adorable grass cat in particular. All right, so the story behind grass cat is something that I might be involved in a little bit. Mm -hmm. um, so when we were first routing the routing this, uh, we used to use a Pokemon called Flamingo. Uh, it looks like a flamingo, and it's a fl uh, flying fighting type Pokemon. Somebody that might be, you know, running this game right now found this item called Grass Knot that you just saw me use on this, uh, this cloth. Mm -hmm. What Grass Knot does is it does damage according to the weight of the Pokemon that it's used against. Gotcha. And mm -hmm. these are big, hefty Pokemon for the most part that are weak to grass. And so we use our starter Pokemon, which is a Sprigatito, which evolves into Forgato, which evolves into Miasurata, in order to take out these uh, Titans. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So what you're saying is Grass Knot is super effective against the chonkiest of boys. That's what right. I'm hearing. Grass okay. is super effective against the chonkiest of boys. Okay, okay. So uh, when you said somebody in this in this stream uh that that you know came up with that tactic i just want to be clear was was that me yeah it was so it was all you bees it was all you because i you, i you don't found, remember doing found, it you but found who, the grass knot that that you know sprung sprigatito into the fame that it has right mm. now now see see i would like chat let's, let's take a little chat come over here real quick come over here let's take a little side little side note right here real quick chat um I would like to say, chat, that uh, that is not true. The uh, actual discoverer of this would be Mocha Five. And here's your next uh, here's your next Mocha fact: is that uh, I, you know, only saying this because I was given the go ahead to release some of this information, but. Um, Mocha 5 was actually made completely out of grass. Just sentient plant life. And that's how we learned that. So that just, you know, keep that amongst yourselves. And then, yeah, so, uh, yeah. Oh, I see. I see we're in a cave with uh, uh, Arvin. Yep. And uh, yep. why does Arvin want you to get these eight gems? <laughs> so Arvin is like, you know, I feel that these eight gems have this healing property. And, you know, I, I want to make some sandwiches out, out of these. So, so Arvin is like, Hey, let's make some sandwiches. Let's go to this cave and make some sandwiches, which is these. Uh, what is your favorite type of sandwich? Just curious. Well, um, and and, and chat, what, what's your favorite sandwich shop? There's a poll right now. Yeah, where's your poll favorite for that. sandwich shop? Well, you know, I, uh, I, I have a lot of different uh, sandwiches that I'm a big fan of. I mean, uh, I, I really like. I love going to, you know, Publix, getting a, getting a, a sub, you know, actually a wrap. I like a good, uh, a, a little hot honey wrap with the, the fried uh, chicken tenders. Ooh. But uh, I would say that after watching this run with Arvin, um, you know, definitely a fan of uh, any sandwich that doesn't come out of someone's butt, I would have to say. Um <laughs> I didn't uh, we'll think that was a requirement, but, uh, you know. We'll get there in a minute. <laughs> in about, uh... Give me about 10 minutes, we'll get there. No problem, no problem. We just hit chill. Not, not 10 minutes. Personally, you heard that Blimpies is not on this, this sub list. Mm. Mm. What, what, what That's are our, that feels options? targeted. That feels targeted, yeah. J-Rock. What I'm are the hurt. options? that one piece is not here. We got Pop Belly, Jimmy John's, Firehouse, Jersey Mike's, and Sheets. And thank goodness we don't have Subway. 
I know. No, no. I know. No. We, uh, I'm glad. Out of those, I would say Jimmy Johns. We got this one good Jimmy Johns. Uh, where I am. Mm -hmm. Uh, get get one of those Italian subs, the spicy Italians. Ooh, boy. I feel, hey, you know, respect. I, I I can see that. I can see that. Now, okay, uh, number one side with a good sub. That's what mm. I'm curious about, Mocha. You go the Pickle chip spear. route, the fry route. You Pickle know, spear. The spear. Yeah, I go the spear. Oh, I get that. Hey, hey. Nothing wrong. I'm a big pickle connoisseur, so I get that. I feel that in my soul. Oh, where's Quiznos? Well, you know. Well, where is Quiznos? Quiznos did not sign up to be on this poll, so uh, that's actually on them. I'm, I'm sorry. Speaking of sneezles. Yep, look at them. See, that's why they're on that side. Imagine. Imagine if this was... Oh, look, they didn't got you. No, they got you. I lost my cousin to a sneezle. No. Don't worry, don't worry. I, I'm good. I got poke doll. Oh, I got poke doll. We get All right. It. I'm about to say I, I can't. I can't have this. I can't have this happen again. I can't have this run in like this. Oh my goodness! I sprayed to the same one. <laughs> <laughs> he was like, "Thanks for the doll. Let's fight." You thought you <laughs> got away from it again? <laughs> got away from it again. All right, Mocha, take a left. Hard left. Oh, come on! You thought you thought his right. cousin wasn't paying attention? He won a doll too. Oh, mm -hmm. we, we, we got we got away. Okay, okay. Ratio Rock does it again. Ratio Rock. This is called Ratio Rock, by the way. Oh, you it thought you, know, you ain't not. paid a toll. <laughs> Are we still getting away? It's also Yo, on the SBA. I'm not a okay, all the way. We're gonna, we're gonna we're gonna cheat. No, not really cheat. We're going to get out of here. We're going to be safe. That's what we're doing. Yeah, you better get out the back alleys and get back on the main street. Uh huh. I told you this ain't safe. Oh, you didn't say that and trade the Pokemon here, too. Now you got some muscle in. They were like, oh, you want to keep walking away? We got something. They ganging up on me. Mm -hmm. Knowing where I got to go. Oh, snap. Look at him. Look at him. He caught you. <laughs> they call him Two Toe Timmy. Don't let him get you. All right, let, let's see if I can lead this one away. Come on, come on. Coming oh. after you. There you go. Hit him with the old juke. Oh, oh, break his oh, ankles. Oh, he's fast. Break his ankles. There we go. Moonwalk up on him. Uh, uh, stunting on him. Oh, come on. Can't jump over anything either. Oh, oh man. We gotta be careful. We gotta be oh. okay. Okay, look at this. Look at this. I can run from the rest of them. You can't run from a little deer, a, a deerling. Well, see, they were quick. They, they, you know, kind of really quick. That's why you had to, you had to be <laughs> careful with them, man. You think you run away, but bam, right on the other side, waiting on you. There we go. 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 Beautiful, had to take baby. that left. We love to see it. Had to take that left. And go moonwalk up that mountain. Yeah. Oh, you see another squad no, waiting think, on you. I think in the speedrun community, we call that uh, backwards long jumps. Oh, uh, yeah. Backwards from, long jumps. From, um, okay. from uh, Marluigi64, right? From Marluigi64? <laughs> yes, uh, I do remember that. <laughs> I do remember that game quite... Uh, quite thoroughly if if i'm not mistaken um i do believe that is uh uh someone's favorite game uh in ubaf uh if i, I, I could so. be wrong let me look at the list i do believe it says here that that is uh pleasantly twisted's favorite game is maluigi i believe 64. so pleasantly yeah. pleasantly twisted i believe that is uh indeed a true fact yeah two <laughs> two <laughs> <laughs> that was that would fail because because uh, J Rock know I'm about to get beat to sleep. So <laughs> <laughs> all right, so we in another cave, running up, snatching items. This is why I call it trick or treat section. Oh, uh, so you you getting candies, but you also getting tricked by all these Pokemon trying to get in your way and mm -hmm. stop you. It's like uh, Halloween Horror Nights, but in the Pokemon world. 
Yep. They're jumping out. Look at this. Andy getting in my way. Ooh, got that hyper potion though. Hey. That's a safety item. Or uh, a little bit later. Ah. Mm -hmm. My ankles were almost completely gone. But we got saved. We got saved by our Pokedex. We got saved. We good. We good. Our phone won't let us uh, take ailments like that. Yo, see. Or we can save that for you know all the wild Pokemon we uh, encountered. See, that's that's how you can tell it's a fantasy world because my phone's always trying to knock me out, give me a black eye, something. Oh man, I need me a good. So one. Once it, once it get cracked, you know it's over. Yeah, yeah. You, you know you're about to take an L. Oh, here we go. Oh, oh, oh. We got a call yep. from Arvin. Yep. But uh, we, we're going to decline this one mm -hmm. and actually fly away. And get all the way across town. Yep. We'll come back there later. We'll, we'll take that call a little bit later. <laughs> Oh my goodness! So yeah, no, it's it's all right. Yeah, we've uh, thank you for all who voted uh, that it would be only one time. Um, we have we have passed that now. We are at two. Now uh, I'm gonna do like coming up soon. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do my best to get to get uh, get past that prediction as well. But we'll see. Uh, I don't I'll know. give it about five. I'll give it about five minutes. Yeah, I don't know. J Rock's got that that just that stone cold uh, you know facade. He, he can't be. Can't be tripped. You know, oh, look at look at it. They, are those a bunch of rocks? Oh, yeah. Um, yeah, that's a bunch of rocks. So I know like Geodude, those look like some raggedy Geodudes. Like, what's up with that? What what, what uh, Pokemon was that? They, they some stone cold uh, healing rocks. It, whoa, Lord. Okay. And that's what uh, we need to know. Yeah. Better turn the burners on and get oh, out of there faster. Oh. Oh, you came up on Pudgy and his, uh, his older brother slapping some. We get, we get, we get, we get. Oh, and there was some behind me, too. Mm hmm. They were ready. You saw one was behind you. You about to got got. <laughs> we is about to have some, uh, some King of Fighters uh, yeah. Pokemon in <laughs> King edition. of Fighters round two. Here we go. <laughs> Uh, we all, we almost done trick or treating. Hey. We're about to get our last uh, rare candy in this section. Mm -hmm. And so, what do, what do you use the rare? Like, I know what rare candies are for, but is there a specific like strat use for them in this? You just gonna yeah, eat them all at Pokemon, once? Yeah, make Pokemon like Uber level. Gotcha. Oh, what is what? What was that? Oh, uh, uh, this the is the best uh, Titan Pokemon ever. Yes, this is legally uh, distinct tremors. <laughs> Kevin Bacon gonna pop out? <laughs> uh, you know, I mean, in, in the okay, this is Scarlet. In Violet, you actually fight Kevin Bacon. Um, yes. But in this one, you yes, just you fight the the actual tremor worm. Okay, which Kevin Bacon are we talking about here? Tremors, Kevin Bacon. Well, the original game oh. gives you Tremors, Kevin Bacon, but in the DLC, you can fight the uh, Footloose, Kevin Bacon. Footloose version, yeah. 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 That's the one I'm scared of, to be honest with you. I mean, that's that's that. You you heard the DLC that came out. The, the you know, the, the like, what, er, the new area with the super hard uh, bosses? That's the Footloose, oh, Kevin yeah, that's, Bacon. That oh, yeah, that's... That is. All right. That's my worst nightmare right there. <laughs> So this type is called Oathworm. As you can see, it is the cutest little trimmer uh, that you ever see. Even though it's like 10 ton and 10 times the size and all that stuff. 10 tons of adorable, what you mean? Mm-hmm. <laughs> so as chat notices, you can't just, you know, one hit or quitter these guys. You gotta you gotta go through the, the first and the second phase. Yes. Because, you know, you walk up, you roll up on him, and he's like, hey, what's up? You want some? And then you slap just, oh, I'm sorry. And then they have to go get their power up HM, and then you can uh, body him. Yep. Yeah. Uh, I think this HM, this, is, this one is salty. This is a salty HM. Mm -hmm. 
And, you know, th this run already is pretty salty, so it it's fitting that it comes right now. Yep. I love how Ar Arvin walks up and he's like, let's do it, and doesn't help at all. Oh, there's one section in here where Arvin's like, uh, I want to get to the Titan, but I got a tummy ache. <laughs> like, quite literally, he says, I I'm, gonna I'm feeling sick. I ain't going to this Titan right now. Hey, that I, I, I get it. I use that at work half the time, too. I'm like, look, I'd be happy to help y'all, but mm, stomach ache. Mm, sorry. Mm, mm, sorry, my bad. As much as I would love to, I just can't. <laughs> They call your phone when you're off. That's exactly how you answer it. Mm -hmm. What's going on? How y'all doing? Yeah. <laughs> oh, my, I'm sorry. My stomach. Oh, no. Can't come in. My bad. All right. So he gives you a, <laughs> he gives you a thumbs up for the dynamic work you both did. <clears throat> oh, yeah. He he <laughs> did he did the, the live share of the work. I just, you know, at my mouth's rod, I just... Yeah. Out the Titan Pokemon, like no, you, he he got it real low. You just finished it off. That's all it was. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He did most of the work before I got there. That's what it was. He loosened it up for you. Yeah. Mm. All right. So we're in this cave now. He's gonna get. Yeah, like I said, we got our we got our salty player, our salty eight gym. Mm -hmm. And let's talk about the sandwiches real quick. Yes. No. So, Mm -hmm. uh, so that's what Armin is doing. He's making sandwiches. Like mm -hmm. that's all he's doing is he's coming here, getting these plants, and making them into some some sandwiches. And we get about to get to the best line that Armin says after he makes a sandwich uh, that you will not be able to read because it goes too quick. He mm -hmm. says, "And Bob's your uncle." <laughs> and Bob's your uncle. And Bob's your uncle. So I would like chat to uh, just pay attention to this wonderful scene of sandwiches and just tell me where these sandwiches are uh, stored. Or, or you yeah, know. So, so just like last time, uh, my Karadon, which is a Pokemon I have been riding on, that I had since the beginning of the game that y'all saw. Um, yeah, it's another sandwich. Well, I give him my sandwich. Armin's like, I have an extra sandwich now. But I still give Karada my sandwich. He gets powered up. And and then it's like, Karada's like, I'm going to get powered up. I see another sandwich. I'm going to eat that sandwich. He, see, look, he sees a sandwich, he eats a sandwich. That's what you're supposed to do, right? You see a sandwich, eat a sandwich. Unless, you know, they they yell at you for trying to eat a sandwich. Uh, who yells at someone for trying to eat a sandwich, first off? I mean, it was mine, so, you know, I yeah. might. But but here's, here's the crux of the matter. He's got this dog who's been injured and hurt and all this other stuff that happened in Area Zero where all them, and where did that sandwich come from? Mm-hmm. And one from no pocket. I still, I still say he had where to go. Yeah, where did the go? sandwich go? Man. So that's what we talking about. Butt sandwiches here, you know. <laughs> hey, look, man. I'm gonna just say he has like a back of the vest pocket. Uh huh. I'm also like, just gonna call it a rump roll. That's what it is. I, I still think he has a sandwich sheath back there, but uh, that that's just me. No, that was a he that was a heiny hero. That's what it was. <laughs> Not the butt bagel. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying, you know, this man sitting here, he brings out the beautiful story about this fetch quest for Fido, and we're out here just trying to do the best we can for this precious pupper, and this man come out with a tushy toasty. That's, I just, you know, it kills the moment. Completely just draws me out of it. Oh, I don't know. I, when I when that was first pointed out to me, I'm like, mm -hmm. "Hey, yo, what? Yep, he he brought that sandwich out from where? Mm -hmm. I can tell you where he got it. He got that sandwich from uh from from Cake and Shake. That's where he got it from. Cake and Shake, yes, he did. Ah, <laughs> <sighs> uh, <laughs> three. You alright, What's up? Three. 
<laughs> you good? <laughs> you good, Jay Rock? <laughs> <laughs> Update: I regret googling butt sandwiches. Well, you know this yeah, well, stream is not know, re this stream is for... not responsible for what you uh, Google. <laughs> what you Google? That's on your own time and your own internet history. Unless yeah. you're using a yeah, browser. Four now. Yeah. Uh, I told you, put it down. I'm telling you, every time we get a new uh, Urban Mystica. I'm gonna I'm gonna drop a new uh, a couple more uh, butt sandwich jokes or names in there. So just be ready, chat. Be ready. We got J Rock over here meditating, stone wheel, trying not to <laughs> drop that plush anymore. You know, like once you go, it's like when you get like a flat tire, like you can't just pump the air back in it and you're sitting up straight again you know what i mean oh yeah it's just too like oh, I, yeah. I need complete recalibration at this point like it might be a wrap chat <laughs> it so might be a wrap. Down the all right uh, there ain't oh, no yeah. coming back yeah i like that i like that last minute just uh that last minute juke get out the way you know make sure they don't they, they don't jack you up for your money oh see you almost got snatched now, are you just grabbing every item in your way, or I see you missing some of them? Is there a predetermined route for specific items? Um, there how does actually is. <laughs> so, what you just, the last item you just saw me get was a, an adamant mint, or as I like to call it, just an adamant mint. Um, those will change the nature of your Pokemon. Uh, right now, my nature is modest on my. A grass cat, we just gonna fly over those because mm. I didn't like juking too much. But uh, my nature is modest right now, which I think if there's more experts on Pokemon in chat right now than me, modest is plus, a, plus special attack, mm. minus attack. Yes, that's modest. Uh, Adamant will just flip that, where you have plus attack minus special attack. Gotcha. And that will come up like in about twenty minutes. So, so when you get your Pokemon at the beginning, you look real quick at its uh, nature, and then you kind of just base your route off that. All right. So, Path of Legends is a special, a special beast. Mm. Uh, she had to have a specially curated grass cat to to run it. Gotcha. So it's got to be a certain nature. It's got to be the IVs, which I, I ain't done anything with IVs until I started this game. Yeah. <laughs> IVs have to be in a certain place for it to be runnable. And yeah, which that's kind of why I like this uh, this category. It's because you do all the prep work before you start to run. Oh, uh, see, it's the same route over and over and over again. Mm -hmm. Which chat sees a, uh, we just expertly dodged that avalanche. Um, I would oh, yeah. like to say that, uh, unfortunately, uh, Mocha 2 did not and was lost to a snow run avalanche. Uh, you know, just, you know, let's get some. Let's get some 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 F's in chat for for that. Just it, put some O sevens in chat. Yeah, for that. put some O sevens in chat. Yeah, let's get some O sevens yeah, in really, chat. Really, really rain them down just to simulate the boulders falling. Yep, yep. <laughs> it's you know, trust me, it seems kind of mean, but it's what Mocha Jones two would have wanted. All right, so the stork uh, was giving out babies. And uh, Mocha just came up and said, hey, that's great. I'm going to give out hands and slap this stork around until it had to go get its Herba Mystica. And now it's back for round two after it powers uh, HMs, up. HMs, HMs. The HMs. HMs. Yes, the HMs. Hmm. The arm and making a pun. Like, you want to do something here. Yo, is that little salt lick just chilling watching this battle or yeah, is it arvin's it's arvin's oh okay 
<laughs> this armless little salt lick. I thought little, little, little salt lick just walked up like, hey guys, uh, don't mind me. I just, I like Pokemon battles. Hmm. All right, so that is our third out of five Urmiscus that we get. And we Lion. back in the cave. We couldn't, we get back in the cave. So you know what that means. Mm -hmm. Um, Bees. Yes. Take it away. Well, uh, you know, I did promise y'all some more uh, Booty Cheek Sandwich uh, names uh, every time we hit a cave. So for this one, uh, I would just like to point out that I am still very upset that this man keeps whipping out some gam grinders. Um, some uh, um, just just pulling out of nowhere, just uh, 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 just just double cheeked up on a Thursday, some cheeked up clubs. Um, just, you know, I'm just, I'm, I'm, I'm not, I'm not liking it. It's just, I don't want this man to ever prepare my food because I'm you saying, you're not down with some honey ham yams. No, I don't want those. No, no. <laughs> well, you got some competition in chat bees. We got, uh, we got some booty burgers in chat. Oh, booty burgers. Actually, Ooh. that was, uh, that was, uh, on my list. It was actually a badonk burger. But yeah, Ooh. I still I respect it. I respect it. You know, and uh, you know, I'm trying to get me a sandwich, and then next thing I know, I'm I think I'm going to a popular restaurant, but I end up at McDump Trucks, and I'm just not happy. You know, it just it all just turns sour. Hopefully, not literally. Okay, I hope. I mean, wait, what was oh. this one? Mocha, what was the HM here? Uh, I would like to say it was. Is it sour? Oh. Or I think it might have been sour. Oh, see, it was quite literally sour. So y'all, y'all tell me, might be a little upset right now. So, to be fair, but. I, I feel, uh, I feel your Pokemon every time you use the sandwich. That's how I feel when I get good food. I just feel like I'm powered up. I ooh, feel it through my soul. What's up, Papa? Speak, <gasps> speaking of soul, <gasps> the boss has just sparked for the first time in ages. Oh my goodness! These sandwiches just, really working. Th hey. These uh, these these cake sandwiches, as yeah. TJ said, are working. Just saying, these are these are you know they they doing a lot, and I, I appreciate it. You know, we, we love to help the puppers, even if it's a tukus toasty. You know, we we just out here to help. <laughs> you good, Jerry? You good? Yeah, yeah. Uh huh. <laughs> I'm centered. Awesome, awesome. Well, since you're centered, I think this is a good time to uh, say that this segment of our stream, this uh, run here, is sponsored by Clappin' Culver's. The best cheeked up sandwiches you can get. Yes, that is actually there. But I don't break. That's their that's their special uh, of the day, Dechi. It's a rump roast Reuben on rye. Definitely wonderful. I would suggest it. Uh, no, tomorrow is the posterior paninis. Mm -hmm. Oh, that always Ooh. I always get terrified when I see that. Does this game have fall damage? No, it's just uh, if if you like fall and don't catch yourself either by sliding or by summoning your 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 poke bike, um, it'll it'll like you saw earlier when when you freeze and that phone comes out and slowly lowers you down like you fell off a uh, star road in Mario Kart. It's just that happens and that causes extra time, so we don't want to see that. Oh, yeah, it, it's it's your like it too. Yeah. It should like it to you. <laughs> now we out at the again from that series that PT admire so much. Yes, yes, yes. Um, big, big fan of that series as far as I remember. Um, 
<laughs> well, okay, you know, I, I get that. I, I I respect the the you know the throwback to Booty King Burgers. Um, but Booty King actually shut down three years ago. Um, apparently, there was too much uh, ham in that burger, so we, they just they really, really failed their health inspection. So, you know, I, I if they would still be around, I would have definitely added them to that. But you know, too I much see uncured you. meat, huh? Too much uncured meat. Yeah, mm, yeah. yeah, it was uncured. Yeah. <laughs> So as we see, is that? Go ahead. Uh, what's the the one from Gen Two? Oh, oh Don Fan and Don Fan. Is that Don Fan? That is not Don Fan actually. That is the the eldest of elder cousins of Don Fan, the ancient Don Fan called Great Tusk. Yeah, that's Don okay. Fan's grandpappy. Yep. He was actually there when the first rock roast sandwich was made. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. It was actually made out of the hindquarters of one of those great tusks. So here goes Arvin, like talking junk, like he about to do something. That man is the most threatening stand, uh, bystander I've ever known. I will say the next Titan, Arvin might actually do something. Uh oh, okay. The next okay. Titan, Arvin has to do something. Don't give us Don't. hope. Don't give us hope. <laughs> I mean, but look, look, we all know how this is going to go. This is this is straight up anime style where we're doing all this stuff to help Arvin. That dog's going to, you know, slowly but surely get back. And then once that dog is in, like, pristine shape, something, B the BBEG is going to come down, attack, and then that dog is going to save the day. So we already know how this is going to go. So we're just, try you know, going through the motions. Oh, yeah. Which one is this? I think this is bitter. Mm -hmm. I might have the two flip flops. Let's we'll see. We'll see which HM this is. It's beautiful. I will say they are gorgeous though. Uh, this one's sour. The oh, previous one was bitter. Okay, the previous one's bitter, and this is sour. Yes. Okay. So then I guess that would go well with the Derriere double decker, um, or you know the. Uh, uh, another classic that we've known from this place is the uh, Patootie Po Boy. Mm -hmm. So, you know, that one, that one d depends on what you want it topped with. Um, usually I go with shrimp, you know, just, just a classic Patootie Po Boy. Uh, you know, I, I'm not mad at anybody that likes to change things up. You know, I feel you. I see you. But now we're gonna eat another sandwich and get powered up. And I wonder what's gonna happen uh, to our pupper. Let's see. All right, let, let, let's pay attention here. We'll see. You see, like I said, Arvin, where where are you getting the sandwich and where is it going? So I'm telling you, you already know where it's coming from and where it's going. Oh, look at that! Finish it off. Feeling good. Ooh. Oh, that's the best sandwich ever. Mm -hmm. Now, let's see. Do we do we make any pro progress with the pupper? So, not really here. Uh -huh. They just have this very deep discussion about psychological trauma. Yeah. Because the dog is eating these posterior uh, po' boys, as you yeah. said. Yes, yes. So, but he does seem to be getting better. That's good. Hey, that's that's how we look. Look at that. Look at that. Last time it was kind of shaky pushing itself up. This time we saw him just kind of lift himself and then go back down, kind of like getting that strength back. And I like that. I like that. So I'm confused. Why couldn't you just why couldn't he just take take uh, the puppy to, to the poker center? Uh, that's what they were talking about early, like in one of the previous stops is mm. that it, it nothing worked. No potions, no poker centers, nothing. Oh, wow. Yeah. And now they're talking about psychological trauma from uh, being in Area Zero. Why is it storming? Ooh, I can't no, stand the rain. the rain. Oh, no. I would say that every time. I can't stand the rain. But 
we, we are gonna, heading to our last time. Yeah, we're going to muscle through the rain and get to this last one. Oh, look at this little fish. Oh, it's raining now. Let's have, oh, no! No, Cletus, no! You, you know we got to handle him now. He didn't ate our little friend. We, 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 we were got trying to, to help this little fish. Got to. No. Oh, uh, just missed the range. All right. Can't see bad side of the range. Oh, okay. So it was that tiny little bit that he needed left to yep. go to the second phase. Got you, got yep. you. So we're going to use that adamant now. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Change our nature. Because we got... We need to be uh, plus uh, plus attack at the last section of this. Okay. We almost done. Oh snap! If everything goes, if everything goes well. Hey, I know. This is the last can, time. Can uh uh? Can we get some? Can we get some wise in chat for yes? Because we all believe in Mocha. We all 100 believe in Mocha, no shadow of a doubt. Let's just let's get them uh, let's get them wise in chat because yes yes yes. We believe in this wonderful runner here. So, uh, uh, question for you, bees: Are there yeah. any, are there any uh, any honey or any honey sandwiches that might have fish for those who don't eat, you know, regular meat? Um, that's a great question. Um, <clears throat> I would say yes. Um. Now, one of the, the most popular sandwiches for this, man, look at all them wise in chat. Oh, that is beautiful. Oh, yes. Look at that. Look at that. Chat believes in you. All right. 1000%. All of us believe in you. My guy, you got this. That look, look a little weak hit. We don't care about that. But yes, to oh. answer your question from earlier, there is a fish sandwich from uh, the Heine collection, and that is uh, called the Stern Sandwich. And that okay. is also, you know, it, it's it's nautical themed for having fish, but also the stern is the butt of a ship, so it's a double right there for you. So, okay, we got another grass knot. Hey, we love to see it. Hey, we did. Love we to love see to see it. Through the paralyze, <laughs> love to see it. It's a little rough, but we got it. No problem. All right. Yeah, so so, so we done you? here. Uh huh. We done here. We're gonna go in the cake. Get our our spicy HM. We just oh, there's a little friend. Oh, okay, our little friend's back. Whoa! Oh no! Oh no! Oh, did we just oh so that's the real Titan. Yep. See, I was lied to. I was told the real Titan were the friends we made along the way, but no, it was just a little piece of sushi. That's a little piece of sushi. Uh, See, that's that's like. Thank you for not cold. attacking me with that. Woo! Thank you for being a friend, sushi. Thank you for being a friend. That's all. That's all I'm gonna put so we don't get being scared. So. Yeah. Um, oh, that was a heavy hit. Love it. Oh, they just don't care about you. They going after the chubby little squirrel. You get it, though. Get him. Gotta teach you not to pay attention. Boom, and you're gone. Uh, uh, uh. All right, so that is, that is, if I'm not mistaken, that's the final Titan, correct? That is the final Titan. That is the final, we love to see it. Love to see it. So now, you know, after that battle, we gotta get this spicy Urban Mystica. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. The, the spicy HL. Oh, oh, I love this chat. Chat saying "tell in torta." <laughs> I love it. All right, all right. So we in here, about to get this last HM. Make this final sandwich. And we just need to, we need to, everybody, I need just to channel, channel, 
handle all your energy so that we can get this pupper up and running. Yeah, send, uh, send all your spirit energy to this pupper. This pupper needs to be brought back to its spot and fit uh, that, you know, the focus centers can't do anything for it. Mm -hmm. Which, uh, actually, you know, not to, I really don't want to bring down the mood, but uh, that actually reminds me that uh, Mocha Jones 1 was actually lost to a faulty spirit bomb. Um, yeah, they, they, they were focused a little too much. They went to throw it. It slipped, landed on them, and it was just, it, was, it, it wasn't pretty. It wasn't pretty. Try to do too much English on it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Try to put I a little bit too much English on it. I, 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 that's what I, I see. I agree with you. That's what I thought. They, you know, there's all sorts of fan theories out there, but I think that's what it was. Yep. Okay, so we got all we right. got our puppy, our beautiful pupper. And you just look at it. Look, so, so sad. And all. All Arvin wants is for this puppy to be better and to pull sandwiches from his, uh, to mm -hmm. sandwich sheath. That's, that's all he really wants. Just throw the Pokeball and have him catch it. Exactly. Let's get you know, better. We all, you know, let's, let's, oh my God. <sighs> Come on. What's uh, happening? Come on. That's all we need. Just get up. Just get up. You can do it. And then a cut scene here, beautiful cut scene that you uh that details what happens uh -huh. after the boss of Easter sandwich. It's a beautiful oh. cut scene. Lovely. Okay, let's watch it. Let's get let's get ready to watch We're, we're watching it right let's, now. Oh. See? Uh -huh. it's, it, and yeah. it's over. It, oh. Oh that was... that, that's it. <laughs> Tear jerker. I know. Tear jerker. Uh, that was beautiful. <laughs> you know, chat. Like sometimes, sometimes the best movies are the ones you didn't see. I know. They, it was beautiful too. I just stopped crying, J Rock. Oh. Uh, here, you want a tissue? I got tissues. Man. Okay, I yeah. I'm good. Thank you. I know the generosity. No, it means so much to me. <laughs> Almost so like much. that part in the video we just watched. Just, oh. Lord. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, look, as you can see, back. the boss is back. Hey. Ain't not gonna go wrong with him anymore. Fantastic. We did just get a call from Armin's mom saying to go and get something from the lab. Thank so goodness. that's where we're gonna head off to is back to the lab. We we head back to the lab. All right. Look at that. We brought this beautiful puppy back. Everything is right in the world. Let's go grab this thing for mom. Why'd you stop, homie? Oh. So now we're heading to the lab to grab. To the uh, lab. We had we heading to the lab. No, we got, gotta get that latest cut in. Scarlet's with the mom. Violet's with the dad. Right. Yes. Okay. 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 And so uh, Scarlet is with the past and Violet's with yes. the future. Okay. Yes. All right. All right. Hey, hey. I'm glad you can catch up, Arvin. Um, what's. Oh, so that was the hardest part of the run right there, holding left as you landed. Yes. Yeah. see. That's the hardest part of the run. If you go right, you accidentally go open a wormhole and yep. like everyone drops into it. What? You don't want to do that. Trust me, you don't want to open that wormhole. Uh, no, no. I've seen uh, characters from other games actually come through that wormhole. Yeah, is that what happened to Mocha Eight? No, that's exactly no. What, no. That, that's that. A lot of people say that. Um, Mocha 8 went in to retrieve Mocha 6 and never found Mocha 6. Uh, Mocha 8 did make it back out. That's a common misconception, but uh, we did I lose Mocha 6 confused. in there. I always get confused on that one. Yeah, okay. no, it's it, hey, you know, it, it's all right. It's 
it's, you know, a lot. It's a lot just to, because they were both, they were actually twins. So, yeah. He was, Mocha, Mocha 8 was never the same after that. You know, here I was assuming that all 10 of y'all were twins. Wow. That is, wow. wow. I, I can't believe you just said that, J-Rock. I thought better of you. You know, I've never met Mocha one through nine. Uh, you know, oh. I, that's my bad. Okay, you know my what? Bad. Yeah, okay. I get it. I get it. I, you know what? Easy I've mistake. only heard stories. Easy mistake. Yes. Um, Mocha six and eight are twins. Um, Mocha three, four, and one were twins. Um, Mocha two didn't look like any of them. Um, Mocha five looks just like Mocha ten, but probably about uh 15 years younger you know just never really hit that growth spurt um and then mocha the, the, nine, the facial hair never came in yeah the facial hair never yeah, came in yeah uh and mocha oh, nine mocha. um mocha nine actually that's in the history of the mocha jones this is um the biggest mystery surrounding them is not why there were nine and why this is obviously a plot of clones um, no, it's actually what Mocha 9's face looked like because uh, Mocha. Well, what, wait, what is happening here? Oh, uh, the dog's better. Yeah. And, and now, because the dog is better, we're going to have a Pokemon battle. You about to put that dog back on the ground? <laughs> yes. <laughs> we have come full tell me circle, We did all this for the last 55 minutes. To pick the dog up just so we could be the ones to put it on the ground? I mean, he's got to test us apparently. Make sure that we can go to area zero. And the best way to do that is put the dog on the ground. Hmm. So, uh, trainer of the year goes to Arvin. So now we're going to fight. We're going to fight this. Just this. Look at that chonker. So happy. So full of life. Yeah. Oh, just we just one. need no crits and no paralyze. Okay, there we go. No crits, no paralyze. Oh, okay, okay. All right, no crits, no paralyze. I got my fingers crossed. I'm knocking on wood. Got my toes and eyes crossed, but that's just normal. Um. Ooh, yeah. Oh, oh, oh that's a good one. Okay, we okay. good. We good. We good. Right, all right. We came prepared. We came prepared, y'all. Yeah. So it's items I was picking up earlier. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I knew. I knew it. If I had to, I had to use this. Mm. Okay, here, just get this. Oh. oh, now we gonna flower trick on. Oh, oh, mm. oh. with the sass. Mm. With the sass, delete. Invoke. <laughs> Invoke. <laughs> Mm, Scovillian. The hottest Pokemon. Indeed it is. Did you just slap that? Did I you did. You slap the, the I did. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Like, first you vogued, then you just slapped the Pokemon right back into the Pokeball. And now we hit him with some, some more sass. Oh, love it. Yep. Mm. We're going to be sassing the rest of the way. Hey. It is sass uh, sass and I ain't mad at it. <laughs> and your honor, this is just salt. The salt. salt. It really salt is boy. just salt. It really is just salt. Fancily structured salt. Yep. Yep. And that one ain't gonna lie. It, it truly is just salt. <laughs> <laughs> now see. Here's my question. How does Cloyster fit into all this? Because uh, I get using the, the, the chunky squirrel because, you know, like nuts and nutmeg, stuff like that, you know, that kind of earthy flavor. Then there's uh, Scoville, you know, the peppers and, you know, stuff like that. Then we got the salt. But then we just come out of nowhere with Cloyster. What's your meat going to be? Okay, so we just talking about like fish, just fish in general, like some of that that oyster meat. Yes, but there was a lot of different. Yeah, I mean, but 
A oyster sandwich? I mean, oyster poor boys. You didn't see him. You seen where he he pulls the sandwiches from, so it, it doesn't surprise. That's also me true. Point. Oh, oh, we going. Oh, we going ham. Okay. Yep. We really throw our hands. Oh, now. what is this? This is a new mechanic for the Scarlet and Violet games called terrestrialization. If I uh, yeah. yes, where uh, they get a like they get kind of like a little power, uh, another power boost. It's it's this game's gimmick, which uh, apparently all the boost in the world didn't help that puppy as you just put him uh, down. Yep. So now Arvin's gonna uh, sorry. Now, now after this, Arvin's gonna go find another young Pokemon trainer to run around and beat up ancient Pokemon to get his pupper back up and hopefully not get slapped down again. The cycle continues. Anyway, so now, now that we have proven that we at least can take care of ourselves, Armin's like, we need at least two more people to go to Area Zero with us. And where are you gonna find two And people? so, I don't know. we'll see. But Arvin's gonna run off, and time is gonna be whenever this egg cart fully disappears. Hey, yo, hold up. Why is he so fast? Oh, no. And Tom. I mean, the way he get his Pokemon beat up all the time, I'm sure he, he's used to running. And yeah, he used to <laughs> run it. But that was Pokemon Scarlet that, at the Legends. That was fantastic, homie. Wonderful, wonderful run. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. I will say one more sandwich name just to send us off. Haunches Hoagie. Boom. Haunches Hoagie. That's it, right there. Haunches <laughs> <Anches, anches> Hoagie. <laughs> I have been Mo Kids Jones 10. You can find me on uh, on Twitch, on YouTube, Twitter, just about everywhere. Mo Kids Jones 10. Um, where I'll put out uh, by PBs on YouTube and be learning speed runs on Twitch. Um, and I do uh, other content everywhere else, like just random stuff. Who knows? Uh, thanks to the PT for having me. She probably won't have me back again <laughs> after we get what, what Bees and I were talking about. Uh, thanks to uh, Game Sun Quick for having this event. And, uh, Bees, your shout outs. Hey, thank you so much. I appreciate it. Yo, I love uh, I love every time you run this, you invite me back for uh, more tomfoolery on the couch. Uh, I, I, I love Pokemon. I love uh, talking about booty sandwiches. Apparently now that's that's the thing. Um, and <laughs> I just, you know, I'm blessed to be here uh, in this event. This this wonderful event that is just exploding um as as time moves on um i i would like before i shout all my stuff out um uh big thank you to pt big thank you to our tech team for all the runners hosts commentary everybody that made this this entire four-day weekend what it was um and you know they don't go anywhere i just want to say this is not over we still got some amazing runs coming up so don't go anywhere um, I, I, uh, I just want to thank, you know, everyone involved and let everybody in chat know if you know black speedrunners, you know, talent out there that doesn't know about this or maybe a little, a little, you know, send them here, here you know, a little nervous, send them here, send them here, let them, let them know what's up. Um, but yes, you can find me on Twitch at big underscore B E A Z. Um, and practically anywhere else on the internet at biggest underscore bees, B E A Z. Um, yeah, just again, thank all of y'all for having me here and allowing me to act a fool. And I uh, appreciate it. Real quick question J Rock, what was the final hat count? Four. 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 Oh, oh, Four. God, I almost forgot. <laughs> I almost forgot. Um, chat, chat, come here, come here, real quick, chat. Um, I didn't want to say this in front of Mocha Jones, um, but actually, it's just been discovered recently. Mocha Jones 9 
is actually J-Rock. I'm, it's right there on, on, on live. Caught in 4K. Mocha Jones 9, if you rearrange the letters, spells J-Rock. Boom. <clears throat> so yeah, no, I'm sorry. Go ahead, go ahead. What, what you were saying, homie? I said we're at four. <laughs> I said we're at four. <laughs> no, tried. no, the hat's still here. I tried for all here. the fives out there. I tried. <laughs> I saw that four had like the least amount and I tried to stay here out of spite. That's how I tend to operate. <laughs> but while we're on the topic of sandwiches, remember, chat, your subs, your prime gaming subs, gift subs, bits, all of that, shared on this Twitch channel, help me direct, directly help support events like this. So if you like events like this and all the other hot fix shows that we got going off, show some love if you can. We greatly appreciate it. Uh, don't go anywhere, chat. <laughs> we got more coming up next. We got more Pokemon goodness coming up next. With Pokemon XD, Gale of Darkness coming up, starring, how do I turn without dropping this? Starring Peas. We're back in about five minutes, everybody. Don't go anywhere. Or do. Go get some water or something. We'll be here. <laughs>